Scene 3, The Monastery of St. Anthony, by the Monument to the Knight Commander. Don Juan. All for the best. Once forced to kill Don Carlos, I'd no choice but to hide here as a monk, a humble anchorite. Now every day, I see my chaste, exquisite widow come. I think she's noticed me. But so far, we've kept our distance. Yet tonight, I'll dare to speak to her. About time, too. How shall I start? Do I have any feedback? Or what's... Oh. Yet tonight, I'll dare to speak to her. About time, too. How shall I start? Forgive the effrontery? Or just, senora? Ah, doesn't matter. Whatever pops into my head, no plans at all. Improvisation best expresses love. What's keeping her so late? She should be here now. Doubtless her knight commander's bored without her. He seems like such a giant in his statue. What shoulders, like a second Hercules. The man himself in life was skinny, scrawny, so short that he on tiptoes wouldn't reach to his own statue's nose. Puny, yet rash. When we were dueling by the Escorial, he simply threw himself right on my sword, froze like a dragonfly stuck on a boy's pin. Yet he was proud and bold, though unforgiving. Ah. Oh. Here she comes. Doniana enters. And that man is here again. Holy Father, if I distract you from your meditations, forgive me, Don Juan. But it is I who ought to beg forgiveness of you, Signora. I fear I do prevent you from giving melancholy fullest vent. Doniana, no, Father. For my sadness stays within. With you nearby, my prayers may reach the sky ascending meekly. So I now beseech you, in devotion, join your voice to mine. Don Juan, do I dare pray with you, dear Doña Ana? I'm most unworthy of such happiness. No. I won't profane with my lips sinful the holy prayers your dear lips do speak. No, all I dare is just to look with reverence, just dreaming from afar when you incline your head as your black tresses fall on marble whiteness, spilling mournful grace. Then I'll believe in angels, because in angels visiting this grave, my shy heart's wounded. No place in its left for Latin prayers. Mutely I gaze, I pine. Praying but to you, I think, happy that man whose cold white marble tomb is warmed by such divine soft breath, sprinkled with such devoted tears of love. Banyana, these words you speak, they're very strange indeed. Don Juan, senora. Doniana, holy father, you forget that... Don Juan, what have I forgotten? That I'm unworthy? A mere monk? A hermit whose sinful voice should not echo so loud in these hushed precincts? Doniana, I, I nearly thought you... I misunderstood. Don Juan, no, not at all. You found out all, all... Oh, Doña Ana, found out all? All what? Don Juan, that I'm no monk at all, for which now prostrated at your feet, I pray, forgive. Doña Ana, oh God, get up, get up. Who are you, sir? Don Juan, a miserable slave of hopeless passion. Doña Ana, my God, not here. Not by his tombstone. 
What do you think you are? Don Juan, one moment, Doña Ana, please, just one blessed moment. Doña Ana, what if someone sees? Don Juan, I've locked the gate. Just one, one blessed moment. Doña Ana, well, what? Speak. What is it you want? Don Juan, to die now. Yes, let me die right now here at your feet.